Hello everybody, in today's video we're going to talk about Call of Duty Mobile and it's become very popular recently because it's a free to play mobile game that is available worldwide. So I took a look at Google Trends and it looks like a lot of people out there are looking on how to play COD Mobile on PC. As you can see right here, it makes up a majority of the search results. So I thought I'd walk you through how to make sure that you're able to play on PC if that's something you're looking to do. And obviously there's several reasons why you'd want to or not want to play with keyboard and mouse, but at the end of the day, it's really gonna come down to preference and there's literally nothing they can do in game to stop people from playing with keyboard and mouse. But I decided to make the video for two separate reasons. One is if you didn't know that you could play with keyboard and mouse, now you know. And if you wanted to play with keyboard and mouse, I thought I'd show you how. So if you find the video helpful in any way or if you're just enjoying COD Mobile, make sure you do hit that like button. If you're brand new around here, you'd like to find your way back, make sure you do subscribe with notifications on. So the first thing you're gonna have to do is go to this website, which will be linked down in the description, and then you're gonna have to download this free emulator, which is basically an app that you can run on your computer that allows you to play mobile games with keyboard and mouse. So once you've had a chance to download, install the Game Loop emulator, it'll pop up like this on your window, and then you'll have to search for Call of Duty Mobile, which is right here. It's really easy to get to because it's a hot item right now. I already went ahead and installed it. It'll be a button right there where it says play, or you actually click it and it'll go through the install process. Once you've gone ahead and clicked play, after you've gone through the install process, it'll just pop up in another window and that's how you'll be able to play. And the first time you log into the game, you'll either play as a guest, but if you wanna link it to the data you already have on mobile, you're gonna go ahead and have to sign in through your Facebook. Right here, you can see it loads up. I went ahead and clicked full screen. And since I've already had a chance to log in and level up and stuff like that, it'll automatically take me to the main page since I've already logged in with my Facebook account. So right here, you can see it loads up. It loads rather quickly. And that's pretty much how you do the setup part of it. I would highly recommend getting to level 21 and trying to go for your tactical nuke since it only requires a 20 gun streak. So let me know how you guys are liking Call of Duty Mobile down in the comment section below. Hope you guys did enjoy the video. Thank you guys for watching. As always, have a great day.